Eiffel. London, 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 London. Eiffel. This is Kogan Cassius for iFilm London. We're at Alexandra Palace for the show London Calling. With me, I've got the new IBF international champion, Lee Purdy. Um, how do you feel of that belt around your waist? Great, it is unbelievable great. I, I felt really good in there tonight and I would barely even got started. Yeah, obviously it didn't last very long. Um, a lot of people were, I spoke to, were actually tipping the other guy. I'll be honest with you, they were. Because, because of the guy's record and two punches going in. But obviously you went in there and showed what you could do. You know, I've had 18 wins and 12 knockouts, I think, now, and, and that still doesn't show how hard a punch, and it's, it's well over 50% of a knockout ratio, and I, I punch really hard, and um, with kids like him who's going to stand there and take him, they're going down. Was you expecting the fight to be over so soon? Um, in a way, sometimes, yeah, I, but it was it was, it was was hard to, to see, to judge how strong I really was until I do come out against a puncher, but I kept my hands nice and tight, and through counters, and every time I clipped him, he, he was just looking for a way out. I mean, we can't dismiss this guy's record, but at the press conference, he was uh, walking around and he looked quite up for it, didn't he? He was uh, shadow boxing in the middle of a press conference, which we saw, and, yeah, but, and everything. And like I said, it didn't seem to phase you then. And obviously, looking in the ring tonight, it didn't seem to phase you there either. No, of course it didn't. And um, <clears throat> if, if he wants to dance about three three days before his fight, let you saw it. I'm not, I didn't just yeah. make that up, did I? He no, was doing yeah, that. He, he, he was he was shadow boxing three days ago, and he was even <laughs> doing it in the hotel this morning. And it, it, I, I, it must have just been nerves. And w when he got in there, he, he, he realised he was in a big, with a big puncher himself. Well, let's f uh, imagine for a minute I'm Eddie Hearn, um, and I say you can have any fight you want tomorrow. What, what do you want? Well, uh, it's Denton Vassell. I've been calling him out for a long time, but. Whether he takes it or not is, it, is a different story, but I'll, I'll leave it up to Eddie and see what he can come up with. What about your old, uh, your old British title? Oh yeah, I, I'd love to. to uh, I, I think Gavin and Witt is fine for it, and I'd like to have the winner. Um, credit to your team, obviously Tony Sims and, and all the boys. Yeah, we've all, we've all put a lot of hard work in this camp, and uh, especially Tony, and he's in the gym all day, every day, and um, <clears throat> he's thanks to him where I am today. And uh, part of obviously Alexandra Palace tonight was taken over by Colchester. Yeah, I had a big crowd there tonight, and uh, I'm glad I did. All right, have you got a message for your fans? Uh, just thanks for everyone for turning up, and uh, <coughs> that it was it was overwhelming when I walked out there. Follow him on Twitter at Lee Purdy One. <laughs> need some more followers? Yeah, I do need some more followers. <laughs> all right, all right. Congratulations, Lee. Coogan Cassius with Lee Purdy for iPhone London. Thank you very much. Thank you.